Hello, welcome to the latest breaking news. In this video you will see important news on use of trending and breaking. Please like this video, subscribe this channel. Scream and run. 90 Day Fiancé. Before the 90 Days fans react to Ingrid seeing Brian in his wheelchair. 90 Day Fiancé. Before the 90 Day Season 7 Episode 2 was much awaited because Episode 1 set a gripping premise. Episode 2, released on September 8, showed some couples of the show meeting for the first time. Ingrid and Brian were among them. Brian, a 51-year-old wheelchair user from the U.S. who works as a cab driver, went to see Ingrid, his 32-year-old Brazilian girlfriend in her country. Before meeting him at the airport, Ingrid was documented talking to her friend Vilani. She expressed concerns about how her parents were going to take her dating a specially able person. Her friend said Ingrid would move to the U.S. with him because she had always looked for gringos so she could leave Brazil. Fans of 90 Day Fiancé Before the 90 Days are reacting to Ingrid's situation and Brian's appraisal of her acting normal when she saw him in a wheelchair. They thought that wasn't something to appreciate, while others commented she was dating him for a visa to the U.S. Brian didn't think that Ingrid reacted badly when she saw the wheelchair. What did he expect her to do when he saw the wheelchair? Scream and run, a fan wrote. Brian is her ticket out of Brazil. She not gonna let that wheelchair get in the way of that, wrote another. Ingrid is a single mom of two small kids who is dating a quadriplegic from the USA. I'm getting vibes here, a third fan wrote. Seeing Brian in a wheelchair for the first time is the least of Ingrid's worries. Read one comment. Fans of 90 Gay Fiancé before the 90 days are also noting the fact that her friend implied she was always looking for an American so that she could move out, and believe that she might be making the move for money or other material expectations. Ingrid is completely freaked out that Brian is in a wheelchair. So, I need to know one thing. How much money is Brian sending her? I need a total amount, a fan commented. I'm guessing it's less about the wheelchair and more about an American who is closer in age to her, wrote another ex-user. I feel bad for the Brazilian lady being a single mom and losing her job during COVID. But let's be fair, why would your parents not accept Brian because he's in a wheelchair? That's your own projection, said one fan. Ingrid was nervous while waiting for Brian to arrive at the Brazilian airport on 90 Day Fiance Day, before the 90 days. Brian had broken a wheel in his suitcase and was taking time to get out of the airport, because he had to push the luggage trolley through the arrival. When a restless Ingrid saw Brian come out, she instantly smiled. She rushed to him and they hugged each other. They both teared up as they sought each other for the first time after texting and chatting online for over two years. Brian said he was happy Ingrid acted normal when she saw him and didn't seem bothered by his wheelchair. Ingrid said that he was beautiful the way he was and that he matched her imagination. New Episodes of 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Day Season 7 come out every Sunday at 8 p.m. ET on TLC.